And try to find something that makes you feel a little better. Yeah. I want him to change his mind. I want him to stay. I want him to want me. I want to be wanted for me and and no one else. That doesn't feel any better, does it? Mm -mm. So keep talking. Um, I'm just tired of being angry yeah. about it. Yeah, yeah, we're on the way back to yeah. Phoenix. Yes. Yeah. It's all right. Yeah. Just just keep reaching. You're just reaching for some relief. That's what you're reaching for. Mm -hmm. You're not trying to explain it so much as you're just trying to find a way to give yourself some relief. It's okay to feel bad. Um, so what if it only lasted a month? I can still be at, sad and angry about it, um, and it's okay, you know, just to be where I am. That does feel better, doesn't it? Yeah. So sort of an acceptance somewhere. Mm -hmm. Keep talking. Yeah, and I'm frustrated that that's where I'm always going to be. That I'm not going to get to where I want to go next. All right. Now let's talk about this. Where's frustration on this realm of pessimism? Better or worse? Um, frustration pessimism well they're pretty close vibration yeah, so close. so you didn't hurt yourself much and you didn't gain much so ramble there and let's see if we can get any good out of this frustration yeah well I feel like I'm just stuck in this groove you know that I'm just driving the car in the same rut basically that's what it feels like <laughs> and I'm not going forward or backwards like I'm just starting and stopping well, she is taking a little more control in those statements. She doesn't feel so much like a victim. We think that those statements are feeling a little bit better, but not very much. So keep rambling. You're reaching for something that gives you a feeling of relief. Yeah. And this is where I get stuck. Like, I don't know what the next thought is. Well, it's is. because it's because you think that the next thought is about what to do, when really the next thought is just about soothing you. In other words, I don't have to get it all at once. There should be some joy in the journey. I'm going to love bringing myself into the position of being adored. I think I'll practice being adored before I attract someone to adore me. I think I'll practice the feeling of being adored. And I think I'll practice the feeling of adoring someone. I'm just going to practice that feeling. I'm going to look for evidence of it out there. Oh, I can tell they adore each other. Oh, they adore each other. I like that feeling. I'm going to practice that feeling of adoring each other, you see. Yes. That's really what you're wanting to do. You're a little bit afraid of adoring mm -hmm. from past experience. And so that's sort of what's stuck. But you can feel that that's what's necessary, can't you? Yes, absolutely. Have fun with it. Be easy about it. In the meantime, be playful about it. In other words, the next one that comes, say, well, I want you to know that I'm looking for a life partner, but don't worry, I've already figured out you're not it. So, <laughs> so let's just have fun. <laughs> I'm looking for the love of my life and you're close, but you're really not it. So don't worry. I'm, I'm not going to hook you in and make you stay. But meanwhile, want to have some fun? In other words, and, and then say, uh, pa pardon me, but I'm looking for a perfect relationship and you have quite a few of the qualities I'm looking for, but there are a lot missing. Do you mind if I just mine you a little bit for data for a little while? And then, then I'll be done with you soon enough and we can go our separate ways. But meanwhile, I will have get, in other words, that's what's happening. No one wants to admit it <laughs> no one wants to admit that I, I'm just feeling time with you while I get more and more clear about what I'm doing but really that's what everybody is doing you see yes. and so don't feel bad about it but have fun with it mm -hmm. yes thank you yes indeed. <laughs>